Hi guys, in my last video I complained about this Toyota Wish coming with only 15 inch rims are a little too small for a car this size so I decided to change to 17 inch rims um, I think the overall look of the car is excellent it looks a lot more beautiful now with the new rims and new tire the circumference of the tire is still the same with lower profile but it's a lot wider compared to the old tires so it does feel a little bit better a little more steady and uh, it goes on the road line a lot better but other than that nothing significant in the driving experience it is still more or less the same but I love the new look of the car with the new rims I think it looks absolutely beautiful I have always loved the look of this car I think this is one of the best looking MPVs you can ever find in the market it is very slick and slim exterior design is beautiful and it's aerodynamic at the front is very low to the ground so this car is made for those who really love uh, driving I'm sure a lot of Toyota Wish owners would feel the same way this car drives excellent um, it corners very well because it's very low to the ground it's aerodynamic it's very quick and responsive it comes at 1.8 liter engine four cylinder naturally aspirated engine pair with cvt transmission something that is phenomenal about this car is the fuel consumption the car may look very big and it can carry seven people um, it feels heavy but it's not sluggish at all it's very quick very responsive uh, it's, it glides on the road very smoothly and the fuel consumption is just as much as Suzuki Swift the tiny car and I also know a few people who try out this car and they don't quite like because of the poor visibility they can't see anything um, they, they those are the people who love to sit in a car that's very high to see the road more clearly but to me it doesn't matter it doesn't bother me I have no problem maneuvering around I, I feel like this is a very easy car to maneuver around town and very quick very responsive you just put your foot down the rpm will rave up very high and it's very quick to take off and see what happens when i put it down <laughs> it takes off quite fast um, that's why i like it and it's very economical on fuel now the last row of seats you can fold them down very flat and you can also fold down the middle row if you want to carry more things and you can do pretty much the same as an SUV in this car and it's got this little compartment where you can put all the tools which is very neat very nice another thing I complain about this car is that because it's an MPV it's quite long it's to accommodate seven people it's got no rear aircon vents but it's very hard for me to criticize on this point because this car was not meant for Malaysian market and um, this car was built for Japanese market and Malaysian people love Japanese quality especially cars used in Japan and we bring them used to Malaysia to use here in hot climates and we complain about what we don't have here when the car was not really meant for Malaysian markets so I think uh, it's not fair to criticize on that and after living with it for a long time I think it's quite okay because the windows are tinted really dark so it does keep the sunlight out and it doesn't feel as hot as it should the only problem is it feels a little dark inside and uh, having this car I think putting a reverse camera is a must especially when it's gloomy outside you can hardly see what's behind you at all when you reverse you really need a reverse camera to see what's behind otherwise it's very difficult to uh, maneuver around in the dark now the interior design especially the dashboard looks very stylish but it's got no center console especially cars in the early 2000s and uh, it's got this cheap armrest here so that does bother me a little bit because uh, you want to put stuff inside here and you want this place to look beautiful the place where you always come in and look at it and see it um, unfortunately it's got this empty spot here which does look a little weird to me other than that everything in this car runs great it's beautiful 
I love the car, it's very cheap to maintain, it's a nice car for family. You see many of this in Kuching because apparently a lot of people love this car, including me. I've driven many cars but this still remains one of my favorite cars. So thank you for watching, if you're new to my channel please subscribe.